you all welcome back to my channel my name is a t you can call me t or sunny whichever one you like and i am back to show you guys this makeup look right here it's a nice little holiday inspired makeup look but i want you guys to watch me transform from a basic bit to a bad bit you know so if you guys want to see me transform and watch how i do it then definitely stay tuned to this video all right you guys so I just primed my face with the MAC Fix Plus. I love this stuff. Like, it's freaking amazing. If your skin gets dry in the wintertime, definitely pick you up some of this. As you can see, I've been using it like crazy. But I've been using it on my clients as well because most people in the wintertime, their skin gets kind of dry. So, this primer is like the best primer for dry skin in my eyes. All right, so now I'm just gonna go in with my Holy Grail contour kit. Well, I really don't like this contour kit. It's just the peach in this little contour kit. Um, so now I'm gonna go in with my, well, one of my favorite kits, just because of this like orange color in it. And I'm gonna color correct my face. And most of the time I just color correct my under eye because it's a little dark because I guess, you know, I know, you know, I haven't seen a lot of sleep, so it's a little dark. And then what I did was I mixed my smash up foundation. But I may need another pump of the 3.35 just to make it a little bit darker, but we shall see. So you guys know that I hate doing my eyebrows on camera, so I'm going to actually do my eyebrows off camera and then come back to you guys. But the brush that I'm using is this Morphe B74 brush. It looks like this. And then I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in Dark Brown. If you guys want to update an eyebrow routine, you know I'll give it to you guys. And I'll cater a video just for that. I'm also going to cater a video just towards... Um, how to apply your lashes but if you guys want to update a brow routine let me know in the comment section below as well as up in the card up here all right so i just did my brows and i concealed them what i use for my concealer is the 1108 cosmetics concealer and i also use some of soft sable to just mix that up and make it a little bit darker and now i'm going to conceal under my eyes as well as my nose a little bit on my forehead and um like my chin a little bit just to highlight that area as well, my cupid's bow. And that's it, really. And I'm gonna take my damp beauty blender and I'm going to blend all of those areas out now. And I'm just going to take some of my Laura Mercier setting powder and I'm going to set the nose, my cupid's bow, my chin, and my forehead. And I'm going to blend out the concealer under my eyes. Girl, 
And I'm gonna set that right away because my crease like crazy under my eyes. And I don't need to be creasing. So now I'm gonna dip into my Morphe. I'm about to say Laura Mercier. I don't know why I'm gonna say Laura Mercier. My Morphe 350 palette. And I'm gonna take this color right here as well as this color right here. As you can see, I use these colors the most. And that's only because they're great transition colors. But I'm gonna use that banana color and that other color as um a eyebrow highlight. So now before I start all the way on my eyeshadow, I'm going to contour my nose real quick. And I'm using um, Complicated by Makeup Geek as well as Half Hearted. Alright, so now I'm going to take Coco Bear by Makeup Geek. And I'm using my Sigma Diffuse Crease Brush. This is the E38 brush. And this is going to be my transition color. Alright, so now I'm going to take Cherry Cola with my Sigma E25 brush and I'm going to place that on the outer corner. Cherry Cola is so freaking pretty. And I'm just going to diffuse that out a bit. So I use this really deep purple color. It's in the color Taboo and it's by Makeup Geek. And I use it on this eye. As you can see, it's like a nice little dark smokiness. And I'm going to do the same thing to this eye. And I'm just placing that right on the outer corner. Like so. And I'm just going to build up my crease a little bit. And I'm using my E38 brush. I'm going to take that cherry cola and just build up this crease a little tiny bit. Alright, so now it is time to add this beautiful beautiful ice color it's like this really pretty iridescence color it's in ice and it's by nyx so it's kind of iridescence is really 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 pretty i used it on one of my clients and i was like oh, i have to make a tutorial of this um so that's right so what i'm doing is i'm taking my e58 brush and i'm applying this like towards the base towards my lash line i'm putting it about three quarters um across my eyelid so now i want to take my morphe e19 brush with some of that glitter and just pack that joint on there starting to add my lash line first and working my way up
All right, so, and then I just added a wing liner. I was having some difficulty because I messed up at first and I had to fix it. And yeah, it was just too much. So I used my Urban Decay Razor Sharp Eyeliner and this is a liquid eyeliner. I actually do like this liquid eyeliner because it's really, really, really pigmented and black, which you don't find with a lot of black liners or like grayish black kind of black I want to be black and now I'm going to add my gel liner to the bottom of my lash line this is the color slate and as you can see it's like almost gone this joint is almost gone um and I'm using my E38 brush and this is a Morphe brush and I'm just gonna uh smoke out my bottom lash line So now I just mix Taboo and Americano and I'm using my M212 brush and I am going to smoke out the outer corner of my eye. I'm gonna take my setting brush this is the real technique setting brush and I'm just gonna wipe away the setting powder all over So now for the top lashes, I'm going to use this Dior Show Mascara and coat my little lashes a little bit. Now I'm just going to take my Urban Decay um, Mascara. This is a Perversion Mascara and I'm going to coat my bottom lashes with that. I coat my bottom lashes with this one because it's waterproof. Sometimes my eyes tear up. So now I'm going to highlight. I'm going to use my um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Highlighter Palette. This is the Glow Kit in That Glow. And I'm going to take, um, what is this, Bubbly and Dipping in Gold. And I'm going to use that for my cheek highlight and for my nose highlight. Now that your girl is glowing a little bit, I wanted to take my Morphe M179 brush and I took those two colors I used on my nose contour. I'm going to contour the rest of my face. I'm going to apply my false lashes. I doubled the Ardell Demi Wispy lashes and they look really good. So now I'm just applying my duo lash glue to the lashes. But you want to let it like get a little tacky because it'll get easier to apply to your lash line. So I just blow it in, fan it for like 30 seconds. Alright, so I just wiped off my lips from any foundation and stuff. So now I'm going to take this color called Cinnamon Roll and this is a lip gloss. This is actually a lip butter by NYX. And I'm also going to take this Makeup Forever lipsticks. Lipsticks. <laughs> it's in the color Matte 1, I think.
All right, so now I'm gonna set all that with my MAC Fix Plus spray. All right, you all, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you wanna see next. Um, if you guys want to see more glitter, like tutorials and such, definitely say glitter AF or glitter yes meum down below in the comment section. And um, what else? Oh yeah, don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts. I'm on Instagram and Snapchat. I also will be doing Instagram lives. I started one, I think last week. And you guys, you guys liked it. It's like a little way for me to interact with you guys on a more personal level, like you know what I mean? Um, but also follow me on Snapchat. I am always on Snapchat. Snapping it up. Doing what I do best. You know? And um, what else? Oh, yeah. Don't forget to subscribe and like and share this video with your friends, with your mother, with your father. But anyways, I love you guys so much. And thank you guys for rocking out with your girl today. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Thank you.